it's fixed itself, but apparently it has not. Okay, we'll see. All right, we'll see. Okay, now we're online. Oh, I just, good. I just need to do it. I just need to delete it every week. Okay. So, now that we've given y'all a chance to talk amongst yourselves. <laughs> Howdy. Howdy. We had a great week. Like I said, the weather's the weather's been nice. Um, we've talked to a whole bunch of nice people. Made some new friends. Uh, did some video chats. Um, Misty's been loading more products into the system fast and furious so yes i have oh diana got home oh diana glad you are home that's good she's been in the hospital i'm still checking on these other people yeah they're there okay just making sure i have to have to take care of my youtube folks yes they are oh yeah okay so we missed um where everybody's from so hello for everyone if you're near or far, Pleasant Hill, Missouri, Vernon, Texas, Warner Robins, Georgia, and South Texas, Wisconsin. Oh, El Paso. <sighs> I just saw a thing today when I was at the bank asking you how far El Paso was from Houston. Where was, what was the furthest? Houston, Dallas, or California? Well, Dallas, probably. No, California was closest. I thought you said what was first. Oh, no, what was closest? <laughs> you may have said that. You probably did. But I was like, it's got to be, I mean, closer to California. We got Alabama, kind of New York, Spain, Kansas City, Oklahoma. We've been mailing stuff to Australia. I know. I know. That's that was exciting. exciting. You know what's weird, though? The people in Australia a couple times have gotten their items faster than the people in Canada. Hmm. And I do not understand what that's about, but... Hmm. Me either. There's a Canadian right there. Two. All right, so what do we got going on today? Okay, so you want to talk about the big news? What's the big news? We got so much, I don't know what's the big We're going to open the store. Oh, yeah, we're reopening, y'all. Yes, we are. We are reopening on Monday. Uh, we're, like everybody else in the world... Um, our business has changed and how we're going to function has changed significantly. So we um, have never done appointments before, but we're going to do appointments now. Um, we have to require masks and we'll provide gloves. But um, if you want an appointment, call the store. We'll make you an appointment. Yes. Um, we're going to give each person an hour. Um, we don't want to rush anybody. And generally, people are in and out of here in an hour anyway, even if we have to do any alterations. I mean, but I'll always... You know, there are exceptions to the rule, but you can't just show up at the store. Like we used to just say, oh, just come on anytime. We're here 10 to 6 Monday through Friday, 10 to 5 on Saturday. That can't happen anymore. So a lot of people have called and immediately went into the phone like, oh, yeah, you're open. I'm coming over. <laughs> Don't do that, especially if you're coming from out of town. Do not do that. I would hate for somebody to drive even an hour to get here and then I say, we, we can't let you in the store. So we're under, we're just trying to keep everybody safe. Um, a lot of our clientele, they're sick, you yeah. know, and they're going through chemo and, you know, we just want everybody to be safe as possible and taken and, care of at the same time. And get back to normal as, as fast mm -hmm. as we can. So I've, I feel like if we do what we're supposed to do, we'll be back to normal faster than if we're just like, oh, let everybody in. I hope so. I've always wanted everybody to feel welcome and come whenever they can come, especially for people that are ill. They It's not predictable when they're going to feel good, but we'll, we're going to make the appointment thing work, and as soon as we can go back to normal, we will. But we're just so grateful that we can actually open and um, serve some of the people that um, are going through chemo and really they're losing their hair and they need a wig. So, um, Annette just asked how many stylists we're going to have in the shop to assist us. We, we're always going to have at least three stylists here. Um, probably at first we'll have four, mm -hmm. but the thing is we can only see two people, two appointments at one time. So, um, and so th that's, that's the way in order to separate the two clients, um, we're limited to two at a time. Mm -hmm. So, um, but we'll, we'll have plenty of stylists and if you need to get, bring your styling in or whatever, we'll be here. And Lori, um, unlikely critic, I saw you make, you posted a message a minute ago. We got your wig in yesterday. So. Just wanted to let you know we got it. Hi, Peggy. Yeah, she's even asking why I'm letting you wear the January. You know, this was tough for me. This is mine. 
I bought it. Yes. She, so she had to get I had to too. think long and hard, but I really wanted a pink wig. And the whole beachy wave thing really isn't me. But it's lovely. I love it. It's just fun. It's just at this point, I'm just into anything that's fun. Fun well, and, it's fun and January happy. January is just a girl for all seasons. I love January. And I love it in that pink color on you. I really, really do. Thank you. Thank so. you. So anyway, we covered that January, and that is the part of their new Arctic collection. It's got a PK in it. It Kim's is FS60 slash PKS18, and it's also known as Frost. And, of course, you know what I'm wearing. Reese in the, um, actually, this is the large cap, but this color comes in both the average and the large cap, and this is by Noriko. I smoke a R. Yes. So. And Daphne's, Daphne called it. Yes, Misty's wearing Reese. Yeah, I, I think it's really cute how they can pretty well predict what we're going to be doing. I but know. we're going to shake things up one of these days. And Well, I think I did you. shake you know it what? up. I, I we mean, might even switch sides one day. That will really throw people off. I mean, I got the orchid and chocolate smoke. Yes. That was like way out of my comfort zone. And now this is different. So I don't, do I, I don't ever shake things up. I mean, when's the last time I wore Jolene? I haven't haven't worn my Jolene in a long time, but I'm going to get a new one. Of course you are. (laughs) (laughs) All right. um, Renee Paris came out with a limited edition um, Mother's Day collection, I guess. It's only two wigs, so I mean, I don't know if you can really call it a collection. But we're going to show you those two wigs. Um, We've only got two in the store. We've got... um, a pixie and a beachy wave um and so we'll try them on and show them to you we both have liners on um but because it's limited edition it's not as easy to order um because they once they're gone they're gone so the ones that we have in the store that we're going to be showing you today um misty has put on the website and um it's first come first serve there's one and you're going to see what they are and they're half off right Oh, I just put them as regular price, but I'll go in and then change it. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. Um, that leads me to my next point before we start doing these. They're in a special section of the web shop, oh, the website. Yeah. So it's always the website is shopmimisdallas.com. Shopmimisdallas.com. Sometimes I run all that together. But there is now a section called a special sale. Um, the wigs in there are sale priced. They are... Only what we have in stock. We're never going to place an order if there's a color you don't want. They're only listed in the colors we have. First come, first serve. They will ship out immediately the same day. Mm-hmm. Um, and the price is what it is. Right. And so. these are items. Um, some of the items are discontinued by the manufacturer. Some of the items are things that we chose for whatever reason we're not carrying in the store. There, you know, Another style came out that was very similar. Um, so they're, it, they're just extremely limited, but you can get a good deal on them if, uh, that's what you want. If oh, they we find have the somebody right from Belgium watching. Oh, hi, Belgium. My, uh, best friends, uh, that's where she's from. Her parents and sister and them are there right now. So, uh, yes, someone's asking by appointment only. We'll rephrase that and we will put a post on all of our social media sites. Right. If you're not following us, you have to follow us because you might miss out on something. Yeah. Um, sometimes we might do something on one that we don't do on the other. So you have to make sure you do it all. And we do Facebook, we do Instagram, we do Pinterest, and we do, what's that other one called? Instagram? I think I said that. Oh. Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter. Oh, Twitter. We tweet <laughs> every now and then. I don't, I don't know how to do all that, but obviously y'all know I'm not that tech savvy. But this is not my fault this morning. <laughs> Someone said, Shelly, surely you don't look like the back ass of a sheep. No way. That is not true. Just to get some lift at the crown. Are you talking about maybe because you see that the stripe of the, uh, if that's the case, just use your hands. Show them how to do it, Kim. Just, yeah, use your hands. I just get, get in up here in like I'm scratching my head. And break up that line of the root. See? And then just make it all messy. Then you can start building. Again, um, Powder Cloud is a product that we use made by Schwarzkopf, and it's just a little puff of powder, and you can put that in the crown, and you can start building volume um, just with your fingers. It just builds the volume. Uh, No teasing or steaming or anything like that, just the Powder Cloud. 
Did everybody watch our videos that we did um, with the gray? We did a, a short, a long, and a medium. Um, I don't know why I was bringing that up, but <laughs> that reminded me of one of those videos. I don't know. It's been that morning, y'all. It's been that morning. <laughs> but anyway, if you haven't seen our videos where we do the gray, watch them. And what I did tell Kim this morning is we're already getting other styles in and gray that they're starting to make. So we'll continually probably keep up with the whole gray series um, as they come out. And so I, I think I put them in a playlist that says gray wigs. So if you missed them, they're in a playlist on our YouTube that says gray wigs. Hi, Shelly from Idaho. Glad you love your wigs. Shelly, it's Reese. <laughs> Guess what I'm wearing? Reese from Noriko I Smoka R. <sighs> All right. Okay, before we try these on, there was something else I was going to mention from the website. Um, um, Misty's got products loaded on there. Uh, the entire John Renault line is there, uh, which are fabulous products. We also have the Hair You Wear line, which is there fabulous. We've added some other items, like some of the people have asked about what razor Misty uses when she textures wigs. We've got razors on the website that you can purchase. The hot airbrush. Hot airbrush is there. If you own a wig, I almost feel like you have to have it. Um, it's there. Um, just check out all the little things. I mean, it's literally I add something every day. Yeah. Maybe a wig. It may not be a wig. But every spare moment I get, I mean, we're far from fully stocking the website. Or I don't really want to call it fully stocking. But uh, it's going to be, like Kim always says, a work in progress. So you can't just go one time and then say, oh, they don't have anything that I want and never go again. At least check it once a week. Yeah. Okay. So Jennifer's asking if the hats will be on the website. Y yes. Um, we talked about that yesterday, and we're working on getting those all photographed and then so that you can have images. Um, yes, it just takes a lot of time. Um, so the things that are really seasonal that we may not get that many in, I may not post, but the things that are an ongoing thing, like we love the Weekenders from um, Flipside Hats, those will be on there and some of the blingy baseball caps. But things that are just like in and out the door, eh. But yeah, we're going to be doing some head coverings. But if like you that. ever see something that we have and you think you want it and it's not on the site, just call the store. Uh, we'll, I mean, we ship from the store. Yeah, it's always quicker probably if you do it through the website first. But if you absolutely can't find it on there, give us a call and we'll we'll do it. All right. Uh, okay. Oh, it's good to be back. And I think it's going to be good to be open. I just want to see people. Yeah. Let's talk about the other thing before we put these on. What other thing? It's Mother's Day on Monday. It's Mother's Day on Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> um, Sunday. Uh, Mother's Day is always on Sunday. Missy. I know that. <laughs> Y'all, it has been a very stressful day. <laughs> it has been. Misty's worked really hard. So what day is Thanksgiving on this year? <laughs> That's an inside joke, too. Sorry. Uh, it's on. I'll pass that test. It's on the fourth, <laughs> fourth Thursday. <laughs> Right? I don't know. Third or fourth. It's always a Thursday. <laughs> it's a Thursday. <laughs> but that was an actual question. Someone asked us, what day is Thanksgiving? Yeah. Anyway. Um, so it's Mother's Day. So this is part, this is, um, again, I, I hesitate to call it a collection because it's only two wigs. But this is what Renee Paris came out with for Mother's Day specifically. Um, in fact, when they ship the boxes, they put this pretty little paper on it. I just think that's so cute. It is Never cute. It's that. floral on the top and it's yeah, lavender. It's like Mother's Day. I only go with red, but it's still cute. Yeah. Kim wants this and she's like, I wonder where you get that. And I'm like, it's paper. We could just <laughs> go to Hobby Lobby and make us some. We try to make the packaging on cute for people that order. But what I was getting around to about it's being Mother's Day Sunday before we try these on is about our coupon code. Oh, well, our coupon code is double. I mean, it's not double coupon, but it, it's two meanings. Um, we are so excited to be able to open, and we're hoping that this is going to signify the um, downturn of COVID-19. Everybody can be healthy and get back to work and get back to their normal lives. And it's Mother's Day. So the coupon code is going to be MOM19, and you can get 19% off um, the online store shop mimisdallas.com it's a site-wide sale so you can get 19% off products wigs whatever you want to buy 
Yes. And there's that no code limit. will be active um, at probably two o'clock today. So our time. So just you got to give it time to get the wig talk Wednesday over and just to get it loaded. So if you're going there to place an order, just give me a little bit of time. And if it doesn't work, then you know it's not there yet. But it'll be mom 19 we we decided we are tired of hearing covid 19 right so we were talking about and what we, can our coupon code be and we certainly don't want to celebrate covid 19 but we do want to celebrate the fact that um we're seeing light at the end of the tunnel right and our mothers yes and our mothers so mom 19 and it'll be back oh shelly Ann says she loves our pink wrapping oh, oh she good. got her taylor and sandy silver oh good awesome good. yes kim came up with this idea she wants it to be happy when you open the box so it's like hot pink with a little cute little sticker and well i just thought you know when you order lingerie it always comes in this tissue paper and they have the little sticker on there and you're like oh it's i mean you bought it for yourself and they should never so ordered you, lingerie. No one, but you just open it, it's like it's just happy and i was like wicks are happy they should be in tissue paper That's right. they should so Yes, Deborah. Even the discounted wigs, everything on our website, and that's going to run through today, a little later, through Sunday night at midnight. So Mother's Day midnight. You can take advantage of it. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Victoria is asking another question. <laughs> it's like we keep. Uh, she said, "When you order the wigs from the manufacturer and receive them, do you make sure they are styled and nice before they are sent to the customer?" Oh, yes. I can answer that. Um, we actually had one this week. We had a customer that ordered um, a Lexi and Mochaccino R. Um, and you weren't here that day. Anyway, um, I opened it and I'm looking at it. I'm like, okay, it's a relatively new style. I don't think it's supposed to look like this. So I pulled out another one that we had and it literally had no curl to it. I mean, it just, it had enough movement that it just looked like a bad mistake. She texted me a picture and I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, no. So I sent a picture of the manufacturer and I said, look, I'm not, I am not shipping this to this customer. You need to replace it and send me another one. So I'll get that one in probably tomorrow. But we do do that. Uh, we check the bangs because sometimes the bangs are a little funky. We look them over, make sure it's hanging right. Um, sometimes on the bobs, one side may have a little bit more bend than the other. Um, so they're not even. Uh, so yeah, we do that. And that's one of the, um, well, it's part of our customer service to you, and it just saves you time and money on the on the end. I mean, if you get something drop shipped straight from a manufacturer and you get it out and you're not happy with the way the bangs are or whatever, then you got to pay money to send it to somebody or take it somewhere and have it fixed. Right. So that's or our promise to you. if you don't want you. it, it's a restocking fee. Right. Is that we won't send you anything that we haven't examined ourselves. And so far, everything we've sent has been examined by us too because we've been the only ones here. But yes, it'll always be put on a head. It'll always be going the right direction when it's in the box and to you. Right. So, um... Uh, Lori said that she felt so bougie when she opened the package. <laughs> I just love oh, that word. Oh, good. That bougie. just makes me feel good. It was just one of these, the stores closed. And, I mean, we've been doing everything we can to find happiness. I mean, there's mm -hmm. there's a lot of blessings that came out of this, but there's a lot of people really hurting. And so, you know, the days of being closed get long sometimes. And so we're just always looking for something happy. And I looked at the pink tissue paper one day. I'm like, that's happy. Mm -hmm. Wigs should come out and be happy so someone posted a little bit ago that there was a shop that had to close in california and i mean and we realize we're extremely lucky yeah. we really are yeah so um support i mean i always tell people local first you yeah, know i mean your, your restaurants i mean your service everybody that is is having a really hard time i mean we ha i haven't gone to a restaurant yet even though i've been able to but every time even when i go to sonic i go to sonic every morning and get us drinks you know I tip a little extra because I, do too. I mean, even though they're probably making more because more people are eating and, and things like that, but shoot, I mean, everybody's struggling right now. They are. So they are. So we're all in it together. We try to help each other out, and I've done the same thing and tried to tip better. Well, plus I'm saving money, so I'm like, I might as well. <laughs> I mean, I can't even bring myself to online shop. What's wrong with me? Well, I just want to, like, touch it and try it on. and I did buy some shoes, though. I almost did yesterday. I had to stop myself because I thought, you know, you have to try them. Shoes I have to try on. Yeah. I have to. Um, I don't. I just, you know. I order from DSW.com or Nordstrom Rack. Or not Nordstrom Rack, but Nordstrom. Because they're so easy to return. Yeah, they are. But I just love me some online shopping, but I can't even bring myself to do it. Because I'm ready just to get out there. All right. Well. Okay. Yeah. And get on with it. Somebody said that they caught the end of it. Well, what you don't know is that we spent 10 minutes trying to get it going. So, we're technically <laughs> in the middle. 
<sighs> and this, okay. So what are we gonna do? All right, we're just gonna put these on. Okay, one is called um, Pretty Pixie with a pretty paper. Oh, God. <laughs> Let's save these and we'll put them on. <laughs> no, whoever, whoever decides oh, that true. they want these, they get the paper true. because they deserve it. Okay, so I'm doing the Beach Wave Bob, and the color is in Melted Marshmallow. Um, like I said, these are probably not something we are going to stock. So when you, if you like what we have on in these colors, you can get them from the website. But we're not going to be doing the other colors. But and there's only is, one. Yes, there's only one, one of each, and it's what you're seeing us put on. And it, this is Melted Marshmallow. And I've got Mochaccino R. Uh, this is a machine-made cap. Uh, Shelly says she's looking for a pixie right now. Girl, have you not got the jet? Now, I hate to even say that because it's so back-ordered right now, but that jet is, oh my goodness. We went through and looked at what colors we had in stock, and then we got the list from Aesthetic of what they had in stock, and we ordered everything that they had in stock. Um, but they don't have... Um, they don't have lilac haze. They don't have silver sun rooted. <laughs> a little too modern for me. <laughs> uh, Jet is a great pixie. It's a little asymmetric, but I will say um, we had someone order it, and I cut that little asymmetric part off. Turned out great. Um, so it's just a real tight little pixie. And we're about to do a video where we review the John Renault products, and I'm going to do it on my on the on the on the air. Um, in my jet. I'm excited about that. So, yeah. Okay. So, I get where they're going oh. with this. Joanne's <laughs> in Maui. Somebody said, Misty, no. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why not. I don't know what you're thinking. Okay. Now, everything looks good on you. <laughs> no, it don't. This is case in point. You know, this I'm is I'm not against... crazy about that on Oh, you. I'm not either. And I would never brush a curly wig, but I'm just going to tossle this a little bit. Yeah, the part. You know, I never think this... And this is a little bit too small. Oh, this squeaky chair. I'm sorry, y'all, if y'all can hear it. Your pixie's good. It. I like it better in person than the picture. Uh-huh, your pixie's good. <laughs> I mean, I'm not a pixie girl, but... I can't get over this. All right. This is... I mean, yeah, it's short. It's very short. Let's get the specs on it. Yeah, it's mm. lightweight. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I feel like I've been in, in front of it. Yeah, Linda says we finally found something Misty didn't look good in. <laughs> Got that bedhead thing going. Okay, let me shake it again because I don't know what to do. Okay, the the weight it's in grams. It's in grams. Oh, but everything else brother. is inches. Sixty grams. I don't have my don't phone. Don't ask one of these Europeans. What? How many is sixty grams? We got to do it. We, I mean, we, we got to do weight in inches here in Texas. I mean, okay. the thing is, like, everything in Europe, food-wise, is measured by 100 grams. So, it's always 100 grams. So, the fact that this is 60 grams is extremely lightweight. Did you hear me say we had to do weight in inches? What now? We, we measure weight in inches here in Texas. <laughs> okay. Well, I yeah. Well, that's better. Pull one side back behind your ear. Put a smile on your face. Act like you might like it. It'll get cuter with I your mean, smile. I mean, if you were young and cute. She said, somebody said it looks like spaghetti on my head. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Alicia. You're our rep and I love you. But I don't know what was going on with this. Yeah. The pixie's good. I mean. But like I said, if you were younger than me and a little bit more You know hip, what? I think. You know what I think? it is i think See, for that wig you need a long face i think if you had a long and face you have to be younger and actually do something with it you know i mean and have a bigger forehead and something i, don't I know. mean it, it got better when you pulled it back let's change <laughs> that was a brush you just don't want to have the spaghetti head yourself. their caps are comfortable yeah, they're stretchy and comfy. Oh, yeah, this pixie's cute. Oh. <laughs> it looks better on you than it does me. I didn't even turn around because I just didn't think. Let's pull that back a little bit. 
And sometimes on these that have a little bit of wave, what I like to do is just take it and twist it and intertwine it with the other curls and that'll kind of get it off your face. I mean, it's definitely cute if, if you're a young, really yeah. young, you know, because I, I get, get what they're going for with this whole straight at the ends thing. It's a wanded look, you know, a really good, messy, wanded, beachy look, but it's not for me. No, it's not for me. You know. Maybe Beachy Wave needs a trim, is what someone said. Maybe Beachy Wave needs a... Well, I guess these are for the young moms. You got really overdrank that part. Uh, Janie, the lace front looks funky because it's not a lace front. It's a machine-made cap. Yeah, these are both machine-made. Yeah. Um, they're really at a good price point um, uh, because of that. So, yeah. um, But anyway, this is them. This is them. Happy Mommy's Day. But this is cute. They they show this, the picture on the website, she's wearing it in Silverstone. Yeah. And it's really cute. But I think that's hanging better than what the model has. I mm -hmm. mean, it's... It's cute. Yeah. <laughs> she said they must have gotten the idea from an ungroomed Yorkie. <laughs> my, I have a Yorkie who's really ungroomed right now. <laughs> the other day, I just started, I just got my scissors out and started cutting. And I'm Poor like, Gracie. She's a mess. This thing, I mean, she's got to go to the groomer. Bad. She just looks at me so sad. Oh, and she's like, so, what are you doing so me, precious cute. She's like had most of her teeth removed except for this one. <laughs> she's 13, y'all. She turned 13 on April 30th. And it like goes out like this. So <laughs> I'm sitting there drinking my coffee this morning. And she's just sitting there looking at me with that tooth. It just, oh, just my heart. I just love it. She's just all snaggly. Um... Jasmine wants to know how hard it is to change a part on a uh, basic cap wig. You know, it's style dependent. Sometimes we can change the part and it's easy. I mean, I'll try it. Who knows? It might make this look better. You got some faith going on there. But when, you, <clears throat> when you're changing the part, you're asking it to go a direction it wasn't intended to go. And so you're going to get more volume here. And so for some people, they like that. The it fact that it does more, look a little better. It does look better. Maybe it was just too flat. I mean, it's still like way younger than me, but. Um, which way are we going? The other one? I don't know. I think we can put our others back on. These are on the website. Yes. The sale price is not there yet. So um, give me just a minute. I don't know. For some reason, I didn't know we were doing them on sale. Oh, well, I thought we were know. just doing the normal price. We just on the fly. I mean, we just do whatever we want, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we not nobody tells us what to do. We make up the rules, That's right? Oh, Kim's dog is sixteen. Oh, wow. You know, my Gracie's thirteen, and she has been the healthiest dog. She had some health issues this last year with a little tumor, but um. I've never had her at the vet for anything other than a checkup and her teeth. Other than that, man, that dog's been so healthy. Thank you, Lord. See, I agree. It looked good on Kim, but not on me. No. So that's the Mother's Day special wigs. I think it went better. I think I think it did look better changing the part. Mm -hmm. So anyway, to answer your question, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. And, um, you know, if it's really not behaving then a lot of times the stylist will take it in the back and you know if, if it's we can steam on it and force it re reform that fiber and make it go yeah we can all right what else we got let's talk about the caption contest because i think we missed a deadline we did because there were so many i had no idea there were going to be so I'd, many i had no idea either there were a ton and there were a whole lot that were really really funny so um so we haven't done the um the poll. So what we're going to do, uh, we're going to post three of what, the best comments, and then you guys will take a poll and vote on which one you think was the best. And mm -hmm. um, I mean, there were just like, it was overwhelming. Because I think I posted everywhere yeah. on Instagram. And so we would just keep getting on McKee, and I'm like, we got to stop. And I mean, literally haven't had time to read them through. It's, it's strangely, you would think that we're not open, so we're not that busy. Um, we're. I mean, I'm working seven days a week right now. Um, 
And I've worked way more than I worked we've before. Worked, yeah, we're working way more. It's just, it's a lot. We're trying to get back to people and, um, you know, there's a lot of phone calls and things are taking longer than normal. So um, anyway, once we're back open, it'll be a lot easier for everybody. Hey, somebody, they're calling it the spaghetti wig. That's <laughs> hilarious. I love it. Who doesn't like spaghetti? Oh, it'll be gorgeous on the right person. Every, I'm telling you, and this is one of the things that we say, you can look in here and you can look at a wig and think it's the most awful thing you've ever seen in your life. And it on the right person, it'll look fantastic. So it's about finding what's right for you. That wig wasn't right for either one of us. And that's okay. We're just showing you the style. It's not about what is good for us. Right. But it will... It will find a good home to somebody and it will look great on. And, you know, that just comes back to why you don't prejudge a wig. Yeah. You You know, you always got to just give it a chance because. Oftentimes you like what you didn't think you were going to like. Right. It's like when you go to the store and you know what dress you're going to buy. You know what style it is. You gather a couple of styles, and the sales lady says, "Oh, what about this?" And you're and you're just being nice, and you're like, "Okay, yeah, I'll try it." I mean, how many times and that's have the I one said you like. that's going to be my new favorite wig? <laughs> and it comes in, and it's horrible. Right. And then the one thing I remember when I put the jet on, I was like, "Oh, I was so surprised because I didn't think I was going to like it." And yeah. you know, you just have to have an open mind. Yeah, you do. You do. So, all right. What else we? Okay. So coupon code. Mom 19 will get you 19% off. Your and it, total purchase. Your total purchase. It runs through midnight on Sunday, which is Mother's Day. Um, and, um, and that'll be active in less than an hour. Yeah, Misty will get that up. So, And right now, we are shipping out as fast as we can. Yeah. Most of the time, it's been 24 hours. If it's something we don't have in stock, we get on and we order it immediately. Mm-hmm. We'll contact you if it's going to be back ordered. Those generally are running about a week. So, Yeah, but we do not drop ship directly from the manufacturer. They mm-hmm. come here, we inspect them, um, and if they're not um, what they are supposed to be, we do not ship them out. Somebody wants us to post the website, so that's what I'm doing. So you go, you can keep talking. Oh, okay. All right. You can keep talking. Okay. No, I was just looking at the comments. Um, Oh, hi, Laura. Misty's got on Reese and um, I Smoke a R. Uh, Misty just posted the website. So just go there. Yes. Visit us on all our social media platforms. You did that very well. <laughs> All right. I hope that everybody has a great week. I can't wait till next week because we will actually have people in the store and we can see our old friends and get our tribe back together and practice social distancing. And if you are going to come in, no, you are required to wear a mask. So, um, and, and make you, an appointment. We can't, if you just joined us, it's not like it used to be. No. So if you're coming from out of town, you have to make an appointment. If you're coming from across the street, you have to make an appointment. Right. Um, and you're only we're only allowing one person in with you. So right. if you're again making a trip to come down here, someone sent me a message and said that they were flying to Houston, picking up a daughter and a friend. And they're all and there's like six people. That's just not something that we're able to do anymore. We, we at can't this, do at this that. point in time. No. So um, and you know the I, we're no different than most. We're no different than most stores in the fact that we're having to change everything we do. We're, we're being extra vigilant because a large part of our population is ill. They are going through chemo and they have very compromised immune systems. And we want to make sure that we have everything completely sanitized for them to come in and uh, try wigs on. So, All right. Well, I think it's time we got back to work. Oh, no, we don't have bedazzled masks, but I did um, I did order us some leopard ones, so we've got those. I, we have a black and white paisley, because mm-hmm. we're mostly, I'm mostly in black. And what is that print? I never get it right. Is it cheetah or leopard? I think it's cheetah. But I got those for um, some sort of the girls to wear, so... So we gotta be cute. Okay, everybody have a lovely Mother's Day. Um... Enjoy your mother. We don't have them forever, so be sure you treat her very special like she is. So have a great week, and we will see you next week. Bye. Bye.